All right, so today we're doing a giant set, nine exercises, 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. So exercise one, we're gonna do a squat to lunge complex. So we set up in a wide squat stance, go down into our squat. As we come up, we face one leg, drop the back knee down, face to the front, squat in between, face the other leg, and drop the back knee down. If you're a bit wobbly or unbalanced, you can definitely do this near a wall or a chair to get that extra stability. So that's exercise one. Exercise two is a push press. So if you've got weights at home, you can grab a pair of dumbbells or one heavy weight. Standing up, you're gonna kick your knees forward, press the weight overhead, and then bring it back to your shoulders. Um, so yeah, any weight that you have. If you don't have weights, you're gonna do a polar bear press. So set up in a downward dog position, knees bent as much as you need, and then elbows go out to the side, bring your head towards the floor. So that is exercise two. Exercise three is alternating feet up. So we've got a few options here. Option one, we're starting on our floor. Got our feet bent and we're gonna reach hands towards our feet and come back down, keeping the spine on the floor. Option two, your legs are out straight and you bring that top knee in. And then option three, you come up onto your tailbone as you tuck that leg in. So those are your alt V up options. Exercise four, we are doing a frog squat. So setting up in a squat position, Feet shoulder width apart, elbows come inside the knees, and then we're bringing our hips down and back up, keeping that constant tension on the back of our legs. Exercise five, we have back extension. So we're gonna lie flat on the floor. <laughs> and we're gonna bring our hands behind our ears, keep your chin tucked in, and then keeping the feet planted, we're gonna lift that chest off the floor and come back down. So really small movement just through the back, mid and upper back. Exercise six is a side plank rotation. So a couple of options. Option one is your knees are stacked on top of each other into a side plank. And then you bring the other arm through, plant it on the center and rotate to the other side. You can also do this with both of your legs up, plant the hands and rotate through. So really trying to keep our hips nice and steady and controlled. That's exercise six. Number seven, setting up in a side lunge. You can add weights to this one. Wide stance, we're gonna go one side lunge and then over to the other side. Sticking our booty back, driving our knee, towards our toes. Exercise eight is negative push up. So everyone will be on hands and toes. We're only focusing on the lowering portion all the way to the floor. So you might find you get to a certain point and you have to drop, but that's okay because we're working on the weak point. So controlling all the way down. And then our last exercise for this giant set is plank toe taps. So we're gonna start in a plank position. You push your hips up, reach for your toes and come back down. And then the other side. All right. So those are our nine exercises. We're gonna do 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off for three rounds.